Hey y'all, it's Andrea. I'm back today to open my snack crate. This is a monthly snack subscription. They send you snacks from around the world. This is a pricey one. This is $50 a month, shipping tax and all. I, this one is actually 56 because I added a drink to it. You do have that option. You also have the chance of winning a trip for two in these boxes to wherever the country is, I think, that they've sent you. Dusty box. You'll find like the golden tickets in there if you if you're the winner. Welcome to this month's snacking adventure. I'm gonna go with you. Korea. Okay, you are? Mm -hmm. Awesome. Let's do this good over a little bit for you. Alright, let's see what we got. Yeah, Korea. This should be interesting, huh, Stella? Looks like China. Um, it is an Asian country. And um, there's fun facts listed in here about Korea. Almost all restaurants deliver. They'll even come back for your dirty dishes. That's nice. 19 is the legal age to drink, smoke, and vote. The stores are open till 4 in the morning. When posing for a picture, South Koreans will say kimchi instead of cheese. Kimchi. That works. The reason all roofs in South Korea are carved at the ends is because it gives them the appearance of a smile. That's a beautiful house. Very cool. We have a sticker. A nice thick vinyl sticker. Uh, this, I think, is telling us about stuff in there. We've got the family size. They do have different sizes. Mini, family, and original, and snack crate plus. I believe this is the snack crate plus for the $56 because it's the biggest one and there's soda. So this. What? Hmm. We've got four slips of paper. <laughs> to play, first choose a throwing player. Player two places their tile on the table. The throwing player aims to throw his tile so that it makes the other player's tile flip over. And here's how to make it out of your papers. That's fun. It includes a little um, Korean activity, Stella. How to make a Korean. Dockies, I can't pronounce it. Yeah, and then you make the discs and then you can play the game. How fun. We'll do that. We can do that for family game night. What do you think? Choose it out. That could be my choice. All right. Let's get into the box. Oh, it looks glorious. should for this amount of money. Can I pull out something? Yes, what do you want to pull out first? This thing. Going for the candy? Yeah. It looks like gummy dinosaurs, doesn't it? Yeah. Let's see if I can find them on here. You want to see if you can open this while I look? Okay. This is Jurassic Dino. Good job. A fruit chew packed with Tyrannosaurus fruit flavor. These dino shaped gummies are simply too good to last. Are they real chewy? No. They smell good. They smell like Krabby Patty. Let me show one to you. How are they? They taste like those gummy crabby patties, you know? They uh huh. Make. You're not in camera. Oh. 
I don't like gummies, so I'm gonna pass on trying these. The kids both love gummies, so that can be theirs. Is it good? Mm -hmm. next. What's next? Yes. Honey twist snack. Ooh, that sounds good. Looks like crinkle cut french fries, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. These two things that she's pulled out are both just in the family pack. Crispy, sweet, and oh so popular in Korea. These twisted strips are covered in honey and melt in your mouth. Oh, I can't get it open. Okay. Where's the scissors? Give me the scissors. Did you get a hose? Uh, my mom just came through talking about how my tomatoes need watering, but our hose is broke or it's not working. Probably from the tornado. Here. Sweet and delicious. The aftertaste is really weird. They remind me of cereal, like a sweet cereal. Mm -hmm. It's pretty good. Pretty good. Next, corn chips. Let's see. Corn chips. See this on this list at all. Anyway, this is what they look like. It tastes like normal corn. It doesn't taste like corn on the cob. Weird. Can I have them? I mean, I like them. <laughs> you do? You love them? Yes. Yeah, they're not on my list that I can find. But yeah, they taste like corn on the cob. You want another one? Mm-hmm. Very strange. Mm -hmm. Good. Sweet. Sweet corn on the cob. Very sweet. Will you hand me my drink? Oh, uh, yeah, sure. Yeah, I can't, it's going to drive me crazy. I can't find it. Can I pull out the next thing? Yes, what's next? Okay, I'm going to pull out this. Soda. Milkus. Peach. This is our drink. It's like a peach so soda. It's perfect timing because there's nothing in my cup. <sighs> Shall we try it? Sure. We're going to get you a little cup. Okay. No caffeine, no preservatives, no corn, corn syrup. A carbonated milk beverage. Should I shake it first? Milk beverage. No, it's carbonated. With hints of juicy peaches, mildly sweet, and re wildly refreshing. I think it's peaches good. stink. It smells like peaches. Which to me smells oh, like. Oh, peaches smells so good. Peaches smell so good. I'm gonna try it over ice. Do you like it? Mm hmm. It is good. It's 
super fizzy. Hey, I want some. The raspberry. It tastes like peach soda. It looks like fizz. Just straight up fizz. It's good. Next. Honey butter chips. They sound good. This was in the family pack. Crispy, crunchy, fried potato crisps, seemingly drenched in butter with a sweet honey flavor. You never had sweet and salty like this before. This is from Haiti. Smells good. Tastes good. Looks like a Lay's. Doesn't taste nothing like it. Mm. They're good. So weird, aren't they? The next taste. They're different. After. Uh, it just tastes like a Lay's. Lay's after. The aftertaste. Mm -hmm. It's weird because it's like a dessert chip. I definitely taste the butter. The butter is the strongest flavor I get. Okay. Okay, you wanna do one? Gum. Crunch? Oh, what? I thought it was gum, I don't know. I don't know what it is, it's all in a foreign language. <laughs> it says grape, I can see that much. Great. Let's see if we can find it. Seacom Dalcom, a fruit chew with a sweet and sour kick, an addicting candy found all over Korea. Try either grape, peach, strawberry, or lemonade. Uh, let's see if I can get this thing open. No, oh, man, I wanted to. Is it gum? No, it's a chewy candy. They're like individually wrapped, kind of like now and laters. Let me get one out and show y'all. They're individually wrapped. Yeah, and inside is it's hard. Oh, not too hard. It tastes like the peach stuff. It tastes just like grape gum and gum. Like grape hubba bubba. It's your candy, not the gum, right? Mm hmm. Okay. It's good. A Very bit. similar to now and later. A little bit sour. Mm hmm. What do you want now? This is weird. There's no name or anything on it. This was in the original box. Yugwa, the most traditional Korean cookie made of honey, flour, and toasted rice. You're sure to find this snack during any holiday celebration in Korea. I'm predicting I will not like this dessert. I'm predicting I will. It looks like marshmallows. Just a little. Tasteless. No flavor whatsoever. Yummy. Really? Mm-hmm. Yeah. You can have that whole thing. Tastes like honey. A little. Really? Uh-huh. Tastes to me like styrofoam. <laughs> Why would you eat styrofoam? <laughs> like no flavor. What you'd imagine styrofoam would taste like. Next, Orion Jelly, My Gummy Grapes. This was also in the original box. Sweet and authentic grape flavored gummies that will surely satisfy your sweet tooth. This is not your typical gummy treat. Mm. 
Mm, smells very grapey. It's a gummy, probably. Yeah. I don't want it. I don't know really like gummies. It's very gummy. Like, Sam will probably like it. I'm just chopping this down. If you like gummies, you'll love it. I just don't like the texture of gummies. I like chewing on a piece of rubber to me. It has a nice grape flavor though. This drink is weird. Next, ooh, seafood flavor chips. That's weird. That is very weird. I love seafood. I don't know if I love them in chip form. Let's see. This is in the family bag box only. Made to look and taste just like octopus. These crackers are a classic snack in Korea. Cute, round, and flavorful chips. They're supposed to taste like octopus. Now, I did have some calamari for the first time not so long ago, and I, it was really good, so. Here you go. I don't want it. It smells like seafood. It's got that fishy smell. Oh, no. Oh, Lord, no. Let's see if Ollie will eat it. Let's see if my cat will eat it because it smells like seafood and tastes like it too. It tastes like fish, very fishy. He's looking at it. Oh, he doesn't like it. He put his head away. It's awful. You gotta try one. No. If it's awful, I'm not trying. I dare you. I dare you. I, I double dare you. I triple dog dare you eat 10 of those. No, no way. <laughs> okay, next. Yakwa. And there are three of them. Oh, man, I want to pull out the next thing. Okay, you can. These are just in the family pack. Resembling a glazed donut, these Korean cookies were served exclusively to the upper class a long time ago. But now... Pair great with tea for anyone. You wanna try one? It's a cookie. Yeah. Here, you, oh, you already opened it. Look, it's disgusting. Is it hard or chewy or? I almost spit it out. It's chewy. It's not horrible. It tastes like cinnamon. I don't want it. It's got a weird texture. I'm not finishing it. I don't like it either. Throw these away. I just took a little nibble. We got one more. We'll see if Sam wants to try it. Yeah, I wish the lighting was better in here. The sun. Ignore this area. That's Stella's end table and her stuff is piled up on it. Okay, so I picked this out. We've got no idea what it is. Uh, I saw it. It was like baked potato sticks. Baked potato sticks? Yeah. Let's see if I can find it on here. Yeah, you're right. Baked potato sticks. Thin, crunchy sticks flavored with butter and salt taste like an undeniably delicious baked potato. I had a friend, like a grown up friend on the train. Uh, and yeah. she ate like these little brown things. They were really good. She... Did she share them with you? Yeah. What were they? They were kind of a little bit, um, a little bit spicy. Just a very. Tad. You don't remember what they were called? No. Uh, I can't. I don't. 
I didn't know her language because she was. Oh, she spoke a different language? Mm hmm. Do you just taste like just normal potatoes? It tastes real familiar. They're supposed to taste like baked potatoes. They taste like those sticks that but they don't add cheese. Like just a bread stick. Mm -hmm. Yeah. There's not a whole lot of flavor to them. They don't taste like a baked potato to me. Um, yeah, just a plain bread stick. Not good, not bad. Just there. What's mm -hmm. next, Stella? Okay, I bet these will be good. White chocolate pepperoni. I'm going to try it first. It's like a breadstick dipped in chocolate. White cookie. Crunchy biscuit sticks dipped in creamy white chocolate and covered in small cookie crumbles. You can't get enough of this Korean classic. I want to try This was in the original box. Let's show them first. It looks so good. So good. Is it? Mm-hmm. It tastes like cookies and cream. It tastes like it's a good. milkshake. It's real good. I'm keeping it. I uh, claim it. It's real fresh, too, and light. They're very good. Come on. I claimed them. What's next? Uh, Just pull something out. It's nothing. No idea what this is. It's completely in Oh, this isn't the original box. It says a butter waffle. Everything you love about a waffle smothered in butter but this version is made to take on the go. Try this crunchy snack for breakfast. This sounds good. Oh, it's... Looks like waffle cones, like a nice piece of an ice cream waffle cone. Let's share this. I'm predicting this is not gonna be that great. It just tastes like a cone. <laughs> I can feel the butter around my mouth. Mm, that's good. I don't really like it. It must be like a vanilla wafer or something. You can have it. Cocoa pie. I got mm -hmm. two of them. They look like uh, moon pies. Oh wait, oh this is two different things. This looks like a, a, a moon pie. This was in a mini box. These marshmallow pies are adored by all Koreans. They are regularly smuggled into North Korea where they are as good as cash. Maybe North Korea is gonna be better now. Huh? Um, I'm not going to taste this because we all know what a moon pie tastes like basically and I do like them and I will enjoy it later. I don't like moon pie. Oh, custard cream cake. That does not sound good. Sounds revolting. It comes in the original box. A light, sweet sponge cake filled with a rich, creamy custard. A popular Korean dessert snack that's good to eat any time of the day. All right, we gotta try it, Stella. You try it first. Okay. Looks good on the outside. Looks like mustard. 
It's actually good. It's actually really good, I promise. Take a bite. It's real fresh and soft. It tastes I like vanilla. It, it just, not me either. It just tastes like a vanilla cake. I don't even know if I even ate the custard. Daddy, did I? Um, it's more like whipped cream in the middle. It's real light. It's not a heavy thing like you think custard. It's kind of like whipped cream. It just tastes like a sponge. Yeah. It's good. Very pleasantly surprised. It's very good. I would eat these regularly. I was trying to get a string off my leg. All I got in front of me and I almost kicked them. That's why you should walk out. Every time I drink that drink, it startles me. Not me. Um, okay, next. Oh, yes. Premium, premium chocolate coated cake. That looks good. I don't particularly want to try it right now, do you, Stella? Oh, God. Getting pretty full. This is in the family pack. Delicious sponge cake coated in chocolate and filled with custard cream so that we'll have you saying, oh, yes. Sounds really good. Pushu, pushu, noodle snack. Don't boil it, smash it. It looks like Raymond, it reminds me, it feels like Raymond noodles in there. How to enjoy, step one, open the package, take out the spices and smash the noodles. Next, sprinkle spices. Step three, shake them and enjoy them. Let's find this on there. This was in the mini pack. <coughs> you trial? Mm -hmm. Sure. Oh, yeah, this. Aww. Oh, yeah. so, first we open. Hi. Did he, did, what'd you do with that seafood chip? Seafood chip. The one that Ollie was licking on. Oh, this one right here. I'm gonna put it in his food. Yeah, see if he'll eat it. Look, they do look like Raymond noodles. He's climbing in the box I got sitting over there. Where's the spices? Okay, you wanna help me smash it? Not sure. Punch it. Fun. I want to punch it again. Oh. All right, it gonna... does look like Raymond. Yeah, that's why I don't see how in the world this can be good. But I love Raymond noodles, but cooked. I've been eating a lot of Raymond noodles lately. <laughs> I don't like Raymond. I do. Oriental's my favorite never flavor. Never tried it. Never will. Uh, then how do you know you don't like it? Because it looks. You yeah. probably would love them. Oriental is my favorite flavor, but um, beef's my second. Oh, it smells so sweet. And you put some um, sriracha in it, too. All right, shake it up. It does smell good. Shake it my rock. Where'd all we go? Mm. It's okay. I can see Ollie. He's having a little. Pretty tasteless. I want to look. Here. Never mind. Never mind. See if Bubby might like some. Okay. Next. Looks like some cheese crackers or something. Is this them? 
crispy crackers shaped like your favorite sea animals, dusted with the salty and savory flavor of seaweed. Oh, really? All right then, here goes nothing. All right, there's some seaweed flavored crackers, Stella. He does? Seaweed flavored crackers. He said they just taste like dry ramen noodles. Yeah. That means I like them. Yeah. Regular ramen noodles? Mm -hmm. Look. It's shaped like a crab. How's it taste? Mm. Taste it. Revolting. <laughs> Fishy. I don't taste any fish. It's very fishy tasting to me. I'm not a, a fan of seaweed, surprisingly, because I love sushi. But sometimes it, I don't like the sushi with the seaweed wrapped on the outside. Um, because I just don't like seaweed. That's disgusting. Blew up. Cheese is all it says. <laughs> cheese. If it was cheese, if it is straight up cheese, I'll love it, but I doubt it is. This you got in the family pack. Sweet doughy breadstick with a savory twist. Being smothered in a layer of cheese makes this snack perfect for any time of day. I went to go pet Ollie. He was just like freaking out. Yeah. Is he still in the box? Uh-huh. Can't even see him. I take first bite. You will. Soft. Mm -hmm. I wasn't expecting it to be soft. How is it? It tastes like a sponge. Weird. Really not a lot of flavor. Not great. This sounds interesting. Cheese lemon. What? Saltine crackers with cheese and lemon. Salty crackers with a cheese filling. Okay. Try our two favorite variations, lemon cheese and cream cheese. Which do you like best? Oh. Oh, they sent us both of them. Now, these sound good. I'm going to try the cream cheese one first. I love cream cheese. Now, we're not going to need supper after eating all this. I don't need ice cream. Weird. It's got two layers. Can y'all tell that? It's three. No, four. It's four layers. It smells good. See, look. One, two, three, four. There's three crackers. It tastes like a saltine cracker with a little cheese spread on it. Exactly how it's described. After this, you're gonna have to make me some lemon. Ramen. Oh, really? You want me to make you some ramen noodles now? See how I like it. I'm not going to try the cheese and lemon flavor right now. Because I want these to stay fresh. But they're good. Next, chick chalk. Tiramisu. Looks like a cookie and tiramisu flavor. Let's see if I can find it. Soft and chewy coffee flavored, ooh, coffee flavored cookie with chunks of chocolate chips and cream cheese. 
a sweet and decadent delicacy. That sounds delicious. I'm gonna save that for later too. I'm getting taller. Are you? Mm -hmm. Truffle. Looks like a wafer cookie maybe. And it says truffle on it. Potato truffle. Salty potato in the shape of a thin waffle and flavored with black truffle, making this melt in your mouth favorite. Do you want to try this? No, I'm full of snacks. I am too. It's a big old box. Now, this looks weird. It looks like gummies. Let's see if we can find it on here. Choco Boy, sweet, crunchy biscuit stems, which is cookies, with a rich chocolate topping. Makes for the cutest and tastiest Choco Boy around. That said good, the little cookies, the chocolate stem, chocolate heads. That sound good. <laughs> oh, he's peeking over the edge. You're just like, wait, where are you going? One last thing, it says Choco is all I can understand on it. Where is it? Stella, help me find it. Do you have another one? This is, uh, okay, here it is. Sweet, puffy biscuits filled with rich chocolate cream. This snack has been a staple in Korea for years and is the best sweet treat to take on the go. Okay. That was it. For this box, there was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Looks like twenty-four snacks, including the soda. Um, well, twenty-five if you count these separately because they're listed together. It was very interesting. Very interesting box. Some revolting stuff like the seaweed. The grossest things to me, this is the grossest, the octopus flavored chips. This is a close second to the grossest. Um, the best, syllable, were those cookie dip things the best to you? They're lovable. My favorite, there was nothing here I really loved. I guess I have to pick this as my favorite because I ate the whole thing, the custard cake, surprisingly. They usually don't like cream filled stuff. Um, okay, what'd you guys think? There was a lot of sweets in here. Less, more sweet than savory. What'd you guys think? Give us a thumbs up if you liked the video and subscribe. Subscribe if you like to watch them. See you at the next one.